What's up everybody, it's your boy The Greatest A16 coming to you with some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3 beta gameplay. Today I'm on Team Deathmatch, actually of course it's not today, the video is dropping today. But back then I was playing Team Deathmatch, it was just me, none of my Merc Clan members was on. I'm running with the Razorback uh, gun, I done switched up my guns, I also got a different uh, specialist, I got the one with the Annihilator. So y'all gonna see some action of that specialist uh, getting that uh, handgun, which is a straight monster. You'll see some gameplay of that. So what I want y'all to do is pay attention because y'all know I was using the CUDA before and I switched over to the Razorback. And just notice how much difference the Razorback is when it comes to accuracy versus the King CUDA. If y'all haven't been watching all my videos, I linked some in the past with me using the CUDA. But the Razorback, I might have found my go-to gun, y'all. This Razorback is pure accuracy and it's a monster so if you guys like the content uh, it's team deathmatch this was my first game actually playing team deathmatch on the beta when I played and I just recorded I did pretty well but nothing too extravagant just wanted to get y'all some gameplay of team deathmatch uh, on the map stronghold with me using the annihilator so if you guys like the gameplay make sure you give it a thumbs up for your boy you know that helps me out a ton if you're new to the channel smash that subscribe button also share this video tweet it facebook it uh youtube share google plus just help your boy out a ton with that uh and also make sure you guys comment below tell me what you guys think about the annihilator class and the razorback gun let's go ahead and get to this team deathmatch action let's go baby you know let's go So what's up everybody, you guys like I said in the uh, opening of this video, this is some team deathmatch. I figured I would do uh, just a live commentary over my video. My goodness, I should have I should have killed one of those two people, that was hot garbage, hot garbage. But the wall running on this game is so legit. It really makes for easier access and I'm not showing any great parts of it right there in the first two you know, a couple minutes of this gameplay. Seeing as I died, getting shot in the back, and I couldn't kill either one of those guys. But the wall running is pretty dope. I love that aspect of the Black Ops 3. Uh, but like I said, I'm just doing some live commentary over my actual gameplay, so you guys may hear uh, faintly my actual original talking gameplay. But I just wanted to do some commentary just to give my thoughts on the game so far. Uh, and just of team deathmatch overall. Team deathmatch is a mode. If you guys aren't new, if you got, if you're new to my channel, you know I very rarely play team deathmatch. It's too many campers. All right, and plus mainly in my old from advanced warfare, and when I play with a lot of my clan mates, I really uh, just do hardcore mainly because that's what my teammates and clan mates like to do is hardcore. And hardcore deathmatch is just a straight camping fest. It's so ridiculous. So I very rarely play team deathmatch. When I do play it, standard standard team deathmatch ain't as bad as as I thought it once used to be. Maybe it was just a bay with a, Maybe I just got in a good lobby. That was I should have cleaned him up. That was an epic fail. I think I'm about to get a revenge soon. Oh no, not right here. Actually, it's gonna come a little later. But uh, yeah. So team deathmatch. My thoughts on it. As far as the Black Ops 3 part, I mean, I actually enjoy it. I literally probably play like three games of it and it was just when I was on by myself I didn't play with any of my clan mates I'm more like to play the objective based games uh, kill confirm domination the new game mode safeguard I got tons of that gameplay coming so make sure you hit that subscribe button to be on the lookout for my safeguard gameplay that's gonna be coming but I think I'm gonna love that game mode a ton right now I'm using this annihilator like I said I was gonna get it uh, earlier in my intro this this gun this is a pretty legit uh specialist to me it's not better than like the little gatlet gun that you get on the sith i think uh, the guy's name is for that specialist but for a handgun it does do one shot one kill you know you can't get mad at that and it's very very accurate for it to be you know one shot i mean for it to be a handgun uh it's not as bad in everywhere that i thought it would be 
So that was actually pretty legit. Uh, in the intro, though, I mentioned the Razorback versus the Cuda. If you guys about to, I'm about to get some long shot kills, I think, coming up. I hope it's right now. Like I said, I'm kind of just talking over this video. I, I don't remember where everything was, but there's some long shots that I get in this that I don't think I would have been able to get with the CUDA. Just like leaning and looking over that way straight ahead. Those, the CUDA, I think would have been kind of more everywhere and it wouldn't have been as clean as a kill. I probably could have got it just like I'm getting these, but it wouldn't have been as accurate as I was. The long distance accuracy on this is a lot better. So I get a hell storm out of it. Only, I think I triggered off and only get one kill though, which eh, for an L storm, that's not that good. But I'm doing 13 to 5, so that's not bad. I hear somebody coming up and I didn't turn quick enough to kill them. Too busy looking at my score. Here comes the revenge when I get it that I was talking about a little while ago. But my thoughts on Black Ops 3 has definitely got me excited. Uh, your boy's got a week off from, oh my goodness, this, the arrow thing with the explosion. I was so mad about that when that happened. I tricked that all the way up. But your boys got a all the way off to the next week. So, you know, be sure to check out my channel because, you know, I'm going to have tons of gameplay for you guys uh, just right out the gate. I'm going to be gaming. I may start off originally because of the actual uh, game and the game mode. Or, I'm sorry, the actual uh, story mode is going to be co-op. I may actually do that first. I tricked this all the way off. I was trying to get y'all some gameplay of me actually hacking. Uh, something or anything and so I pulled out the black hat and somebody was coming around the corner I wasn't paying attention uh, and so I died but I messed around and got this annihilator this is a pretty good couple kills I'm about to get with this annihilator you guys see on my map is nothing but tons of people around I couldn't get him my teammate got him but I get him right there so as you see the annihilator like I said it's a pretty legit specialist uh, as long as you have it up, you know, and ready to go, it's literally pretty accurate. You, you can't miss it. I'm mad I took a death right there. But tell me what you guys think about Team Deathmatch. If you guys are big game players of Team Deathmatch or not. Uh, if you guys like more of the objective-based gameplay. Uh, tell me what you guys think in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think about the Black Ops 3 beta. If you guys are excited for the game, if you're not, what game modes you guys like. Like I said, I got tons more gameplay. I just played a little bit of Deathmatch. I was on here by myself just kind of wasting time, waiting for some of my uh, clan members to get on. And so I figured I'd hop on and get you guys at least a couple games of Deathmatch gameplay just to see how it is. And like I said, I did get some good kills in off that Annihilator using that Specialist perk. Score 73-67 coming to an end here. Uh, we, you know, 75, 69, we get the win. I go 18 and 10, nothing too great, nothing too bad, of course. 1.8 kill death ratio, can't get mad at that. Like I said, tell me what you guys think about Team Deathmatch gameplay below. And until next video, guys. When it's on, it's on And I be all up in it like a midget Doing this thing in a minute I surely handle my business I pick a shorty and she freaky diggy Got shaky, greasy and easy You can't tell me I ain't the feast